Bonjour, I'm Hana from evithati.in and in this session we'll learn preposition a and the in French. These two prepositions are very important in French and you have to know when to use preposition a and when to use preposition the in French. So French mein do preposition a or the jo ki bahut important hai aur aapko pata hona chahiye ki kahan par hum preposition a use karenge aur kahan par preposition the use karenge. So we'll start with preposition a. Être pre a. Être pre a. Adjective plus preposition a. When there is adjective and preposition a. So adjective plus preposition a plus verb. Adjective plus preposition plus verb. So sentence will be C'est facile à écrire. C'est facile à écrire. Here we don't have anything after the word écrire. So we use preposition A. When there is nothing after the verb, we always use preposition A. जब हमारे पास verb के बाद कुछ भी नहीं होता sentence में, तब हम preposition A use करेंगे. C'est facile à écrire, which means it's easy to write. Nothing is there after write, so we'll use preposition A. It's easy, facile means easy and écrire means write. So it's easy to write. Next is c'est bon à faire. C'est bon à faire. So there is nothing after the verb uh, faire. So we use preposition a. And it means it's good to do. Faire is a verb which means to do. And bon means good. So it's good to do. Nothing is after the verb do. That's why we use preposition a. When there is nothing after the verb, we always use preposition a. And when the adjective plus a plus preposition a and noun. When there is noun, so adjective plus preposition a plus the noun. For example, une rue entre dit en jean. Une rue entre dit en jean. A street close to people. A street close to people. So here we use preposition a with the plural because there are people. Jean, jean means people. And en rue means a street. Entre dit means close. So a street close to people. A, a, a street full of people. Here we use preposition a. Now the preposition the. So être fonton de. Adjective plus preposition the. When there is adjective and preposition the. For example, the same English expression we used earlier. C'est facile de écrire une lettre. C'est facile de écrire une lettre. So, c'est facile is it's easy. And we use preposition the because there is something after the verb écrire. Here, we have something after the verb écrire. So, we use the preposition the. When there is nothing after the verb, we use preposition a. But when there is something after the verb, we use preposition the. So, बहुत simple the rule है, जब verb, जब sentence में verb के बाद कुछ नहीं होगा, हम preposition a लगाएंगे, और जब होगा, तो हम preposition the use करेंगे. So, it, it means, it's easy to write a letter. So, after write, we have a letter, that's why we use preposition the. C'est facile d'écrire une lettre. Next is, c'est bon de faire les devoirs. C'est bon de faire les devoirs. So, after the verb faire, we have devoir. So, we use preposition the here. Means, it's good to do the homework. Devoir means homework. And bon means good. Faire means verb to do. And we have the word after the verb fair, that's why we use preposition the. 
So when there is nothing after the verb, we use preposition a, uh, and when there is something after the verb, we use preposition the. Say fini, abiantu, messi.